Welcome. In front of me is a Sony Xperia 5 Mark V, and today I will show you how you can record a screen on this phone. So, to get started, we're gonna pull down our notifications by swiping down from the top of the screen and swipe down once again to extend the list of toggles. On one of the pages, you will find your screen recording, so if you don't see it on the first page, you can swipe to the left and this will show you a second page where the toggle is located for me. Once you see it, you can tap on it. It will give us a couple options right here, so we can record audio either. I uh, have it well, by default, it's gonna be disabled. Uh, you can enable it and you can record either device audio, microphone, or both. And below that, we have show touches on the screen, which will imitate uh, where you are pressing the display. Your finger exactly was pressing the display with a semi-transparent gray dot. I'm gonna enable it and enable it just so we can see how that actually looks like. It will also begin a three second countdown and then begin recording. So from here, whatever you will do will be recorded by the device. Uh, now let's see if we have any uh, good application that I could showcase this with. Uh, but nope, it looks like we don't have any app that I could actually utilize. So uh, I could show off some iffiness in the screen recording. Anyway, once you're done, you can pull down your notifications and select stop. Now, what I wanted to do is showcase uh, Netflix as one of the apps that for the most part comes pre-installed with a bunch of devices, uh, which is also one of the apps that has the ability to block your screen recording from being able to actually see it. And in my opinion, at least, it seems like a massive uh, privacy intrusion for an app to be able to control your device and what it can do, uh, which I'm not very big fan of an app that can change settings in my device without me being able to like undo it in a way. So if you ever encounter that your screen recording provides you with a fully black screen, uh, like if you would try to record Netflix, just know that whatever application you are trying to record uh, has the ability to block it from being able to see it. Now, this is for the most part done to uh, for some kind of like privacy, maybe, or security reasons, as, uh, as this was actually intended for. And with that being said, uh, privacy and all that stuff uh, for Netflix doesn't really go too well in, in pair, as you probably could expect there's not much there to protect you from uh, it works also with bank applications so bank apps will uh, will also have the same effect where it blocks it but obviously bank apps are a little bit more of a sensitive application that con uh, contains things like your bank uh, pin codes and stuff like that also your balances and stuff like that so in that case it's a little bit more uh you know viable to block that not netflix anyway um, that being said, uh, the rent, uh, we can now find our screen recording by going into the library and it looks like it's located in the movies folder, right over here. So you can see that's where my finger was pressing. So there we go. Anyway, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.